In this quick lesson, I'm going to show you how to use the new feature in InDesign 2017 for scaling arrowheads. First thing I will do is draw some lines, which are called paths in InDesign. I'm getting the pen tool and I'll draw left to right. Now with the pencil tool, I'll draw another line from right to left. And I'll go back to the pen tool and draw up to down. Next, I will make all these lines thicker so we can see them better. Good. Now let's add some arrowheads and other shapes. On this top line, I'm going to add a shape at the end. In the start box, I will add a bar. And in the end box, I will add an arrow like that. You can see this is a little bit out of proportion. So we'll go back and fix that later. With this second one, we started on the right. But first, I want to give the ends of this line uh, rounded caps. So I think that would look better. I'm going to go up here and click the round cap. See how the ends are now rounded. Now with this line we started on the right, so the start box, even though it's over here on the left, is going to appear. We're going to get a circle on the right. And then the end box will do an arrow. Now see how the ends of the arrow are rounded right here? That's because of the round cap. If I went back and gave it what they call a butt cap, it would be squared there. But I like the rounded one better. Now with this shape, the start is at the top. Let's give it an arrowhead. And then the same arrowhead at the bottom. Terrific. Now we'll go back and fix the proportions. We'll scale the ends. On this one, that bar is too big. So because this link is broken, I can do both. I can scale both ends separately. So I'm going to scale the start end way down. And I think I'll scale the end end way up, the arrowhead. To me, that looks better. Now with the second one, the only thing wrong with this is that circle is way too big. So I'm going to scale that down. That's a little better. With this third one, I would like both ends to be scaled exactly the same. So I'm going to click this chain link. And I only have to scale once and both ends will be the same size. See 132 and 132. That looks good enough to me. To slow this down and see it in writing, check out the blog at bookdesignmadesimple.com. This article is called Adobe Creative Cloud 2017.